Hey guys, this is Greg's Bear Review. Let's go see what's in the fridge today. Hey right, guys, thanks for stopping by Greg's Beer Review today. Today's beer is from Terrapin. It's their side project number 14. This is their Time Foolery, which is a uh, Saison farmhouse. They are coming in at 7.30 ABV. Uh, from the Terrapin Brewery Company out of Athens, Georgia. Limited release. I mean, they brew these things, these side projects once, and then they move on to the next little project. So. Uh, food pairing cuisine is curry, Thai, the cheeses are earthy, camembert, Montana, nutty, asago, even Limburger with this type of beer. Uh, the meat is poultry, fish, and shellfish. Uh, glassware, a pint, Becker, Stein mug, oversized wine glass. Uh, being a 7.30, it can be uh, cellared for extended time. So I haven't had this one really that long. I don't think I've had it six months, maybe. Uh, not exactly sure. Uh, when I pick this one up, so I've had it. I've had a little while, not a long time. So let's get the cap off this thing and see what it's all about. The foil off of it here. I like how they do this. It comes off really easy. It ain't no sticky mess. Got a nice little turtle on the cap. It's the first time I've noticed that on their caps before. So I'm gonna try to save this one. Do it on the bridge. All right. Let's see what we got here, guys. Doesn't look like a saison or a farmhouse. It's rather dark. Well, right darker than any saison I've ever had. Black saison. Uh, it's not black black. It was uh, like a very dark color. I've got some ruby tinges around the outside of the glass. So I am getting just a little bit of light around the outside edges. Uh, it poured a, a nice, creamy looking head on there, so uh, let's get a nose on it and see what it's got. I'm getting the, the funky farmhouse funk to it, but I'm also getting a, a lot of malt there and maybe a little, a little Belgian yeast or something there. Smells pretty interesting, so cheers guys, let's see what it's all about. A black saison farm out sale. Don't think I've ever had one of those before. Now I think what's gonna cause that they use rye, wheat, and uh, black malts to brew this, so cheers. Yeah. Takes a little bit of the alcohol, but very easy drinking. I mean, it's Got a little bit of a metallic bite on the end of it there. Not quite got as much funk as a normal Saison would have. Farmhouse sale. Usually they're pretty they're pretty funky. Got that earthy, dirty smell. This not smell too bad. I like a black IPA, so uh, the black Saison may work for me too. I think it's going to be above average beer. I don't think it's going to be an A beer, but I think it's going to be an above average beer. But try the fridge around 40 degrees, and this is a bomber. It's 22 ounces, so 
I'm going to slip on a little bit and see if it warms up and changes any, and I'll be right back and we'll do the final shot. But it looks pretty good for this one. Uh, I'm a fan of the Terrapin stuff anyway. Uh, they, uh, they do some nice stuff. So with that being said, I'll be right back, guys. All right, guys. Thanks for sticking around. I've got just a little bit left. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's an above average beer. To me, this tastes like a, it tastes like a black saison with a Belgian yeast. This is exactly what it tastes like to me. You got the, the Belgian smell and the Belgian taste, uh, a little bit of banana, a little bit of the, the grapefruity type thing, but it's not really heavy, but you can definitely, I, it tastes Belgian to me, so. I left a nice lacing on the glass all the way up, so. I mean, it's not a bad beer. I mean, it's it's a decent beer. So uh, I hope everybody got a chance to pick some of this up. Or it may still be available. Like I said, uh, 15 is out, and this is number 14. So there's probably some bottles still floating around. I, I think they had, still had some at uh, Venezuela when I was there uh, yesterday or day before when I was there. So smells <sighs> good. Final chug, guys. Very nice. A little bit of fruitiness there in the end, but uh, it's, a, it's an above average beer. I'm going to give it a B. Uh, it's a good solid six. It's a B. The, uh, the Rake Beer Rake beer has an 87 overall and a 51 in the style, and Beer Advocate has it a B minus. So, uh, I like their beers. I like what Terrapin does. Most of the stuff they do is pretty good. I like their Hopsecutioner and and, and uh, all, all the beers that they do. They, they do some good stuff. So, uh, Cheers to them, and if you've had this beer, let me know what you think of it. If you didn't like it, like it. Give me some comments back on this one, guys. And if you've seen it, you like the Saison, this is a black Saison with a little Belgian yeast to me. That's what. That's my opinion of what this is. So, guys, as always, rate, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow.